Okay, this is how we calculate descriptive statistics using Excel. What we're going to do is we're going to calculate each value by ourselves using a formula. Now the advantage of this is in case you, one of these values change, your formulas will go, are going to change dynamically, okay? I mean the values in the formulas are going to change dynamically. So let's go ahead and start with this one. Let's calculate the mean. And before you start calculating or doing all the calculations, one um, time saving tip would be to just define all of these, okay, all your data within formulas. You can just define it as a name so that when you call it, I'll call it age data. And that is your range. Click OK. And now this is defined. Now every time we use a formula, we're just going to go ahead and call that variable and it will automatically highlight the range. So we don't have to highlight the range every time we're doing a formula. So I'm going to say equal to, let's calculate the mean equal to, mean is basically the, the average of my age data. That's the variable that I have defined. Press tab. Okay. And exactly the same value. Standard error is basically standard deviation. My data divided by the square root of the number of values that I have. So I'm going to use the count function. Median, I'm going to use the median age data mode, MODE, single. Age data again. Variance is VR dot S. Kurtosis K U R T. The range is the maximum minus the minimum value. This one is an easy one, minimum of age data. This is the maximum. Sum of all the ages. Count. largest the first largest value the first largest value and the first smallest number and finally the confidence and that is equal to confidence that 
that should be the confidence level which is 95 percent and we'll call calculate the standard deviation again and how big is our data the the count of our data that is basically how it's done okay hope that was helpful thank you for watching the video